Ambassador, can you identify yourself? Yes, I'm Barry Quibell. I'm the volunteer warden of Spalford Warren. Why did you join the Nottinghamshire Wildlife Trust? Uh, I joined it uh, when I retired, or when I was still in the police force in Newark, when Graham Page invited me to join at Coddington. He lived at Coddington. That's when I joined. Mm. I've been an active member ever since, and that was in about 1977, 8, somewhere there. I think I know the answer, but what's your favourite nature reserve? Uh, well, obviously, I'm very closely connected with Spalford Warren. I've a dog, I like the Duke's Wood, I think that's uh, very important. Tell me about Salford Warren. Right. Uh, it was a bomb dump during the last war, and I arranged a talk with our local group to tour them around, take them around it, and show them all the details. They didn't turn up, but somebody did from Birmingham who had been stationed there during the war. And they gave me a lot of photographs of Spalford Warren, aerial photographs, when it was taken during the war, when it was a bomb dump. What they did was bring bombs up the Trent in the canal boats, through the flood bank that they took down, into Spalford Warren. They were stored there in the sheds, almost daily, taken to the airfields of Swindaby and all around there. And I have a copy of these photographs, these overhead photographs, in the archives at Newark. So if somebody wants to come round, I can take them down there, get these photographs out, and they will explain the story of Spalford Warren. Briefly, what's special about the Warren? It's the only site of heathland that they've really got in Nottinghamshire. It's very unusual. It's very dry, sandland, and it has a lot of flowers growing in there that you don't get elsewhere. Heathland. Any favourite stories about there or anywhere else? Uh, and there's, uh, no, I can't say it, I honestly do, except the fact that I have seen in there uh, the lesser spotted woodpecker, which is a very rare bird. There are also buzzards in there now, which have only come in fairly recently. So it is an interesting site and it uh, should have a future. Brilliant, thanks for so much. Hope they look after it. Okay.